Well, it is a little bit partly cloudy out there. We can kind of see the sunrise this morning, but we will start to see some precipitation move into the area in the next few hours. But for the most part, we will stay dry for the remaining hours of the morning. Right now, temperatures outside middle 30s for most of us, but a few of us are gotten up into the upper 30s, close to that 40 degree mark. So it's actually a little bit warmer than we've seen the past couple days. Wind chill still taking a little bit of a hit because we are seeing a little bit of a breeze coming out of the northeast at around 10 to 15. 15 miles an hour so many of us it does still feel like the middle to upper 20s out there and overall I think it is going to be a little bit of a cold and winter like day out there several advisories this morning winter weather advisory areas north of St. Joseph starting at 9 a.m. today continuing until 7 a.m. tomorrow morning and north of that this hot pink right here is a winter storm warning that goes into effect also at 9 a.m. today and will continue until 7 a.m. tomorrow because that is going to be the best chance to really see some accumulating snow maybe several inches of precipitation so on the radar right now we did see a small all disturbance moved through in the overnight hours, especially along the Iowa border, seeing some light snow showers, still some dry air in place, so not all of it is making it to the surface as of yet. That will change as we move through the next few hours. But right now things are pretty calm, might have some flurries here and there, but overall dry conditions as we move through the afternoon, that's when it will really start to pick up. Here's a look at your hour by hour forecast. Another cold start to your morning, but as we move towards the second half of the morning around 10 to 11 a.m., so we'll really start to see that precipitation move through the area. Many of us will be in the 40s at that time, so we'll just be dealing with a cold rain. But as that temperature starts to drop, especially along the Iowa border, you could already start to be seeing some snow. Many of us still dealing with rain. Snow continues along the Iowa border. That's where we could pick up several inches of this precipitation. Then in the overnight hours, that's when we all will get a chance of a little bit of some snow as that temperature starts to drop. 44 today for your high, mostly cloudy skies with that rain snow mix. Here's a look at your five to seven day forecast today and tomorrow are definitely going to be colder days with highs in the 40s, but then we'll warm up pretty fast for your weekend. Highs in the 60s with lots of sunshine. Stay with us. We'll be right back.